Hello, VO1DFC here. Uh, it came. I finally got my new transceiver. It is a TYT TH 9800 quad bander. 2950, 144, and 430 megahertz. So let's get into it. Let's see what we got. Uh, we got the manual. And uh what's it? The manual and a certificate of verification tag. Interesting. And there's the transceiver. Just uh, uh for my husband to make some kicks on. Now which way? Just hold on, now I gotta put this down, so if I don't, I'm gonna go on there. Okay. There's the transceiver. As you can see, it is uh, very compact. It's, uh, it's a lot smaller than I thought it would be. Uh, and it looks a lot like the the Azu. The Azu. What is it? The Azu 80, 8900, I think it is. Yeah. Anyway, so there's a look at the front. And you got the top firing speaker. And on the back, you got your PL295 connector, your negative and power leads, and fuse cord. And there's a provision for a speaker and the data that's to program the radio. And yeah, external and data. And of course the radio works on 13.8 volts. The body is well constructed and it feels like it's all aluminum or white metal uh, or some sort of metal. And a very large heat sink on the bottom. Right now the radio is upside down. Very large heat sink on the bottom with a, let's see if I can with a computer type fan on the back keeps everything nice and cool so that's so that's the radio the radio down there let's see what else we got in the box let's see power co power cord uh, this particular unit also comes with the mounting bracket and accessory to take the face off and mount the face remotely so say if you've got like a small Civic Honda Civic and instead of having a radio up on your dash you can just mount the face and just have to face the radio up there the DTT the DTTMF tone microphone is there the mounting hardware and mic hook mounting hardware extra fuses the extension cable for the face of the radio and the mounting bracket for the radio so that's just this is just a quick video just a very quick video on the TYT TH9800 uh, megahertz 130 MHz quad band receiver so I got her out of the box and when I get her hooked up and when I go to make my first uh, Q solder I will uh, make another video or I might just join it in, in this video but uh, yeah so that's the first look and unboxing of the TYT TH 9800. Please rate and subscribe. Thank you.